So keep in mind, no reading can resonate with every Virgo on the planet all the time. Also keep in mind that energies can be reversed. So if I say that you did something and you know that you didn't, it simply means to be aware that someone else in this situation most likely did, whether you are aware of this or not. You may have gotten yourself deep into a situation. You may be feeling as if you are trapped, but that's not necessarily true. That will just be for some. But there's some sort of completion that has happened here. It looks as if there was an ending to a deceptive strategy at work or that you or someone else was working on. It could have broken someone's heart. It could have caused storms in someone's life. But whatever it is, it definitely has some people a little upset. In fact, you yourself, this could be you or someone else, but I'm going to read it as you, are being very cold and distant about a situation, very matter of fact about some sort of transformation that's occurred here. Um ruling over a situation again at work or that you were working on. But because this, there was this ending to this deceptive strategy at work, you're feeling uncertain. Some of you could even be juggling finances, um, not feeling very certain. That's another interpretation it could be. Some of you are planting seeds. You're trying really, really hard to hold on to something. Um, and you're feeling a sense of disillusionment or something like that. You're disappointed. You're disappointed. And you're disappointed about a victory. This also could be about travel or about a car. It could be any of that kind of thing. So, you know, for those of you who were involved in this, you're holding on, you're, you're feeling uncertain. You're holding on tightly, feeling disappointed because you wanted this victory from this deceptive strategy. For some of you, you were a good person and you found out about this and now you don't really know what to do. It's kind of like, okay, now what do I do with this? You're uncertain. You're holding on tightly to the situation, disappointed, feeling conflicted. Okay, so it's going to be different depending on who you are in the situation. So for some of you, there's some type of partnership or an agreement here that was definitely uh, not on the up and up. In fact, it's kind of a snake eating itself kind of thing. It's one of those trickster type of energies. Somebody is trying to get away with some shady behaviors here regarding a partnership, an agreement, or a contract. For some of you, you agreed to be left out in the cold for whatever reason regarding this situation or to be left out of the situation. For some of you, it could have involved somebody that you were in a partnership with that left you out in the cold. So you're being a little bit sneaky. I mean, again, this is going to be depending on your place in this. Some of you are being very sneaky about it. Some of you are just feeling conflicted about why should I help this person or um, something like that. But it looks as if you're hopeful. You're hopeful and you are looking back over your shoulder, whether for good or for bad. You're hopeful that something's going to work out about this situation. But 
you're looking back over sh- your shoulder because you walked away. You walked away from a situation potentially that was beneficial to you and took swift action because of this agreement to be left out in the cold. But in truth, you're still holding on. You're still disappointed. So there could have been an ending for some of you at your work because of this agreement. And you agreed to it, but you didn't want to agree to it. You just allowed it to happen so that a certain situation would come to fruition. I, I want to get deeper into that, but I can't because um, that would take me a long time. But sometimes people have secret agreements. Okay. So if this reading resonates with you, please give it a thumbs up. Feel free to share it. And if you're not already subscribed, please do. And I'll see you again soon. Bye.